make and take. Today we're making a sea drop. Earlier this week I found a beautiful shell. Inside was a letter. It said, Hello, I am Oshi, the Cornish Sea Sprite. I love to visit the museum. Next time I visit, I want to tell my magical story. Can you show everybody how to make some musical instruments that will help to bring my story to life? I can't wait to see what everyone makes. I will see you soon, Oshi. To make your sea drum, you will need a paper cup, tissue paper, brown parcel paper, scissors, glue, pom-poms, three elastic bands, some wooden sticks or straws and foil. I'm going to decorate my drum using blues and greens so it looks like the sea. To start you can use pens, pencils or paint to cover the surface of your paper cup. To add texture, you could use sticky glue to attach pieces of tissue paper. You could add tin foil to make your drum sparkle. add string or ribbon to add extra texture to your drum. Wrap it around your paper cup and tie it in place to secure. Now take your brown parcel paper Place the top of the paper cup onto the paper and draw around. Use this circle as a guide to draw a bigger circle, at least 3 centimeters bigger. It doesn't matter if it's a bit wobbly. When you are done, cut the circle out. Put the brown paper on top of your cup. You can hide the pencil lines by placing them face down. Use an elastic band to secure the paper in place. You can always add more to keep it really tight. To make the drumsticks, you will need two wooden sticks or straws, pom-poms, two elastic bands and two pieces of tissue paper. Take the pom-pom and place it on the end of your wooden stick. Place a piece of tissue paper over the top, creating a connection between the pom-pom and the wooden stick. To keep this in place, secure it with an elastic band. Repeat this step so that you have two drumsticks. Give your drum a try. Your drum looks amazing. Don't forget to bring it to show Oshi. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.